This is Dr. Nerds in our organic chemistry lab at Vermont College. What I want to show you today is how to make a piece of fluted filter paper like this. When you want to filter um, an insoluble substance out of a hot solution, you normally will do what's called a fast, fast filtration or a hot gravity filtration. And you'll want, to you will, you'll want to filter through a paper that's highly fluted like this so, you, so that you get more surface area. Okay? You can also do this when you're doing a cold gravity filtration if you're trying to remove some particulate matter from a solution. So if you want to flip filter paper, it's very simple. Okay, people who like to do origami are very good at this. We will actually do this in class and have you practice a little bit. But what you want to do is you fold the filter paper in half, like this. Fold the filter paper in quarters, like this. Okay, then you open it up. And this is the complicated part. I'm going to take my gloves off so you can see it better. But this is the part where people get a little bit confused. What you want to do is take each fold and fold it inward. So I'm going to take each fold and fold it inward toward the original crease, like this. So it's like, I always say it's like two little doors, two little windows. Okay, once you do that, you're going to create a fan. Or so it's just like when I was a little kid in, in grammar school when I thought I was hot, there was never any air conditioning, we would make fans and we would sit there and fan ourselves. It's like you're making a fan out of this piece of filter paper. What you want to do is take each section and fold it back in the other direction. So I'm folding it back now. Then go with the fold you already have, then fold back again. You see how I'm making a fan? Then fold with the fold you already made, then fold back again, and then fold back again on the last crease. Then when you open it up, you have nice, even creases in your filter paper. Now this filter paper is called fast filter paper, and fast filter paper has bigger pores in it so that the liquids will flow through quicker. But this is going to catch any material that will not dissolve in either a cold solution or in a hot solution. If you want to flute further, you can. Some people take the folds they have and they fold them in half again. But we, we usually work with this kind of fluting because as you can see, it sits really nice in the funnel. And when you pour your liquid through, this will just sit down. You'll get lots of surface area, so things will, flu will flow very, very, very quickly. Okay, so we'll go over that again in class.